Hey everybody, welcome back to my first Let's Play of Super Mario World. Alright. And so now, today's episode, we're going to begin Chuck Island 4, I believe. So let's do it. This is the first level that has these diagonal like elevator pla pa platforms. And, uh, that's just great, I guess. <laughs> Okay. And look at that halfway point already. Isn't that just nice? Nice enough to do that to you. Alright. So it's P switch. There's a fourth dragon coin. And also also this pipe. And this is where your fifth dragon coin is. But it's it's a really hard one. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna like all right, I'm gonna try this. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Did I make it? Yes, I did. All right, I made it. That was awesome. Also hardcore. Hardcore. I have no idea what that was, but alright. Okay. And now onwards to Chuckle Island. Five. Let's do this. Alright. Ooh, one up, one up, one up, one up. Alright. And I'm not going to hit the P-Switch, I'm going to bring it to where I need it. Let's see. Ah, here it is. I'm going to wait until I become the cape. What? No, I want a star. Oh well. It wouldn't really matter that much. But, uh, okay then. Oh no, don't get the mushroom. I don't want the mushroom. This level has six dragon coins, and so that was our fifth one, and here's our sixth one right here. And get out of here, fools. Aww. Okay, and now onwards to Wendy's castle, which this is a really difficult castle. Well, I can understand that we're farther in the game, so expect things to become harder. Wow! Okay, this level, this castle is best with Mario. Oh my god. Now these falling pencil-like things, they... Once you get hit by them, you die. So they're basically your instant killers right there. So I'm just being as careful as I can right now, so I don't die. Come on, hurry up. Don't have time to waste. It isn't Roy's one. Not even close. And since it's not Roy's one, we thought we 
we make it out? Oh, what? Oh, wow. I just let that guy hit me. the fight against Wendy O. Koopa, who was a lot easier than, who was a bit easier than Lemmy Koopa, because the pipes form a straight line, however, there's more fireballs, which is a thing that, make, that makes this a bit harder, but the fireballs aren't such a huge problem. Wow. There we go. Man, five minutes already? Oh man. Well, we'll see what I'll do for the rest of this time. I guess I'll just do random crap, I guess. <laughs> okay, whatever. Whatever I said right there. Um, Wendy O. Koopa of Cast Number 6 has sung her last swan song. Mario and Luigi now see the challenge that lies before them. There's a sunken ship that seems to be a threshold of the dreaded Valley of Bowser. Ah, uh, yes. We're about to make our way to the sunken ship. However, this... This is part of World 7, so we're not going to do that, actually. Instead, I'm going to meet you at uh, World 2 for a sec, so be right back. And we are back. Welcome to Star Road. Alright, yes, we are officially gonna start. It's been so long. Okay, anyway. This time we're actually going to 100% Star Road. Um, uh, here's the track points. Track points aren't really easy to get, this, uh, here. Just let so I'll let you know about that. And, uh, uh here's the next one. We're gonna scroll down if you really wanna know where they are. Okay! Yeah, there we go. Alright, and then it's somewhere to Star, right? Where is the star? I'm pretty sure there's there a star. Oh. oh, there it is. Come here, suckers. Ha 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 ha. Take that. What you deserve. Okay, I think the, the next track point is this way. And then you have to go all the way over here. Alright. Uh. Also, this is a level where you get to see Red Yoshi. However, I still have a Yoshi on me, so I don't, so I can't really show you Red Yoshi. Basically, Red Yoshi, no matter what color shell you eat, it'll shoot fire. All right, so that's the actual exit right there. And now we're going to go and find the real exit for uh, Star World 2. This right here takes to World 3. And here we go. Ah, I screwed that up. Oh well. Okay. Oh! Damn, I missed it. Well, it's not such a big deal, I guess. Who knows? Alright, and so with that, that is Star World 1 and 2 completed, officially. This up here takes your World 4. Hey, look at that, Dragon Coin wrapped up bed. Alright. Alright. Um, oh boy. Why can't I grab things? That makes no sense at all. Huh! I hit it anyway? I hit him anyway? Wow, that, that, that's cool. Oh well. Sorry, Yoshi. But I had to do what I needed to do. Alright, so what we have to do is gotta fly over here. And 
then make sure you do not land in in the finish line. Because if you do, then you can't get these dragon points right here. And that's how you get the dragon points for this level. Alright. Oh, screw you! You just ate my cape! It was my backup line! Dang you! Here! Sucker! Alright, anyway. Uh, this is Yellow Yoshi. No matter what shell you eat, um, you'll pound the ground. Which... Where am I? Oh my god, jeez. Alright, anyway. Here's a secret exit, which will take you to... The next level, and this one takes you to world 5. Um, and, uh, anyway, uh, let's see what we got going on here, um, alright, just got a bit of an interruption there, but now we're going to make our way up to this level, and this level's dragon coins, oh boy, I don't have Blue Yoshi with me, god dang it, I don't have no idea how this is going to turn out, um, you gotta go to the very bottom get this next dragon point right here. And, uh... Ooh. Okay. Do that. Uh, this level has Red Yoshi as well. And, uh, the fifth level also has, uh, red, has Yellow Yoshi. Sadly, Blue Yoshi appears in one level of Star World. Oh well. There's your fourth dragon point up there. By the way, these, these bonus worlds, they have no checkpoints. So if you die, you have to do the entire thing again. Which is something you don't want. Okay, and now... On another bonus game. Let's see if I can... Oh, balls. Okay, that's And now it's time to do this back to the secret way. So let's do this crap. And yes, I did not, I said that because I don't want to, I swear. So we're gonna first let's play, makes no sense. I don't fly on the pit. Jeez, what are you doing? No! Oh man, oh man, the kid's gliding power is so much easier. There's a secret right there. Alright. God, there's gonna be a lot of editing to do with this world. Because this world has a bunch of speeding up to do. Because every single one of these levels have secret exits. Okay, this is the fifth star star world level. Alright. Here we go. Oh! Okay. And then we gotta do here is gotta make sure you control this all the way to the left. Or right, I should say. Now whatever you do, do not press up or down while this thing's trying to move. You can press left, you can go you can press left, but not up and up or down. Just wait for a bit, and then you gotta be very fast. And not get hit or mess up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, of course. What? Give me another Yoshi. I just lost it. After that terrible luck? Oh my god. I want my money back. Alright, anyway. Uh... Actually, you know what? Eh, whatever. Yay, for screwing up. Alright, and Oh man, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna completely beat the entire Star World on this episode. So let's do it. Yeah, here. 
Alright, now the secret exit is you just gotta you require some cape. So just fly up here simply. And then uh you can get this if you want. And then there it is. It's, it's easier it's easier if you have all four switch palaces. And now for special world, which is the hardest world in the game. In the next episode, we are going to start it. See you guys next time.